everyone. This is my post Pride video. Um, I just sort of wanted to put it out there and show everyone how far I've come since I before I started Thrive. Um, so I went on the Thrive program to help with my emetophobia and I can 100% say I'm not emetophobic anymore, I'm just like a normal person and it's so good. Um, I've got some examples of things that I wouldn't do before Thrive and what's happened since. So the first thing, I went on a plane twice. Um, before Thrive, well, when my emetophobia sort of was really bad, I wouldn't have even dreamed of going on a plane. It was that, it was just a nightmare thinking about it for me. I got all sweaty and hot and heart went fast and it just completely filled me up nerves. But since Thrive, I've been on a plane twice. I've tried new foods. I've eaten salmon. I've eaten olives. I've eaten foods that weren't sort of on my safe foods list. Um, a big one, I've drank alcohol. I have drank alcohol in the past, but I always was wary and I hadn't drank it for around six months um, until recently. And I wasn't worried it was gonna make me sick. I just had a little, little bit of Prosecco and I, it didn't even cross my mind. Um, so I'm completely managing my thinking now. I don't worry about stupid things and if I get like an unhelpful thought or something I just think well why am I thinking this this isn't helping me just chuck it in the bin or even better change it for a more helpful thought and a big thing for emetophobes rituals so many rituals and now none of them so right now I don't always carry hand sanitizer I always used to have it in my bag in my car so much hand sanitizer. I don't have it anymore. No point. I always used to wash my hands before eating. Don't do that anymore. Avoided seafood. Well, you know what I should do? Avoid seafood. I don't do that anymore. I used to worry it would make me sick because seafood can be undercooked really easy or whatever. No. Avoided family gatherings. Not anymore. Went to one of those recently. Avoid drinking alcohol. Don't do that anymore. Don't eat too late. Well, when I was on my holiday that I recently went on, on a plane, we got there and we had food about 10 p.m., which is used to be unheard of for me, but I don't I, I don't mind eating late anymore, that's fine. Always drink after food. I used to think that would help keep it down or some stupid thing. I don't do that anymore. Always have water near my bed, in case I'm ill in the night, not gonna happen. Always have a bin by my bed, don't do that anymore, in case I'm ill in the night, well I'm not gonna be so it's fine. I'm the best version of me right now, I am so happy, so confident, my self esteem is through the roof, as you can probably tell. I'm not insecure about myself, I've got no social anxiety, I'm never embarrassed anymore. And I am thriving, completely and utterly thriving. So thank you Thrive and thank you Fiona so much. I am thriving. Mm -hmm.